When you hear the word jungle, what comes to mind? Perhaps it's a thick, almost impenetrable wilderness filled with exotic animals, dangerous predators, and a constant chorus of insects and birds. Now, when you hear the word forest, the image is a bit different, isn't it? You might picture tall trees reaching high into the sky, a calm green canopy that filters sunlight, and wide open paths shaded by leaves. These two words, jungle and forest, are often used interchangeably in casual conversation. But in reality, they don't mean exactly the same thing. While both refer to areas covered in dense vegetation and trees, the difference lies in the structure, biodiversity, accessibility, and the mental images we associate with them. In this video, we're going to break down the differences between a jungle and a forest, explore their unique characteristics, and understand why the two terms are often confused. Let's explore right here on History of Simple Things. The first major difference lies in the structure and density of vegetation. A jungle is often described as an overgrown, tangled mass of plant life. In jungles, thick underbrush, climbing vines, shrubs, and low-lying plants dominate the landscape. The vegetation is so dense that it can be difficult to walk through without a machete to clear the way. Sunlight often penetrates down to the ground in jungles because the canopy, or the upper layer of trees, is not always fully closed. This sunlight encourages thick growth at the ground level, which makes jungles wild, chaotic, and hard to traverse. In contrast, forests, particularly tropical rainforests, have tall trees that form a continuous canopy above, blocking much of the sunlight from reaching the ground. This means that the forest floor is often surprisingly open, with fewer shrubs and vines, allowing for easier movement. So while a jungle feels choked with vegetation at eye level, a forest might feel towering, majestic, and easier to walk through, even if it covers a larger area. Another important point of difference is terminology and origin of the words. The word jungle actually comes from the Sanskrit word jangala, which originally meant uncultivated land. Over time, the term evolved in the English language to describe tropical environments that were especially dense and untamed. On the other hand, forest comes from the Latin word forest, meaning outside, which referred to uncultivated land that was beyond the boundaries of settlement. This historical nuance plays a role in how we think of the two terms today. Forest is more formal, scientific and general, while jungle is more descriptive, emotional, and tied to images of mystery and adventure. Think about it. When movies want to create an exotic, adventurous setting, they usually call it a jungle, not just a forest. Biodiversity is another factor that sets jungles and forests apart, though the distinction here can get blurry. Jungles are often considered subcategories of forests, specifically tropical forests with thick undergrowth. They are hot spots of biodiversity because the dense vegetation provides countless niches for plants, insects, birds, reptiles, and mammals. You'll find species like tigers, leopards, anacondas, and brightly colored frogs, often associated with jungle environments. Forests, however, come in many types, boreal forests, temperate forests, tropical rainforests, and mangrove forests, to name a few. Not all of them are as biodiverse as jungles. For example, boreal forests in Canada or Siberia consist mostly of coniferous trees like pines and spruces, and they don't support the same level of species diversity as a tropical jungle. So while all jungles are forests, not all forests are jungles. One of the biggest misconceptions people have is assuming that the jungle is just another word for a rainforest. While they are related, they're not quite the same. A rainforest is defined by heavy rainfall, 
usually at least 80 inches or 200 centimeters per year, and it has a multi-layered structure, including the emergent layer, canopy, understory, and forest floor. A jungle, on the other hand, specifically refers to areas with very dense vegetation at ground level, often on the edges of rainforests, where sunlight reaches the floor and stimulates thick growth. In simple terms, a rainforest is an ecosystem defined by climate, while a jungle is defined more by vegetation density and accessibility. That's why explorers and adventurers of the past often describe the outer edges of tropical rainforests as jungles. Culturally, the words also carry different connotations. The word jungle often evokes feelings of danger, chaos, and survival. It's the setting of countless adventure novels, movies, and survival stories. Phrases like the law of the jungle suggest a place where only the strongest survive. On the other hand, forests are often portrayed as mystical, calming, or even enchanted places in folklore and fairy tales. Forests can be spooky, yes, but they are also places of wisdom, shelter, and magic. These cultural associations influence how we perceive the two environments, even if, scientifically speaking, the boundaries between them aren't so rigid. From a practical standpoint, the difficulty of navigation is another key distinction. If you've ever been in a dense jungle, you know how challenging it can be to move just a few meters forward. The dense growth of vines, shrubs, and trees creates natural barriers, making jungles some of the toughest environments for exploration. Forests, depending on the type, can be much easier to navigate. For example, in a pine forest, you can often see long distances between the trees and walking paths are much clearer. This accessibility difference is one reason why jungles are often seen as mysterious and dangerous. They hide what's just a few feet ahead. The difference between a jungle and a forest lies in density, terminology, biodiversity, perception, and accessibility. A jungle is best understood as a dense, tangled subset of a forest, usually tropical, where vegetation at ground level is thick and biodiversity is extreme. A forest, on the other hand, is a broader term that includes many types of wooded ecosystems, from the boreal forests of the Arctic to the tropical rainforests near the equator. All jungles are forests, but not all forests are jungles. The confusion between the two terms comes largely from cultural portrayals, historical usage, and the overlap between tropical forests and what explorers once called jungles. So the next time someone mentions the jungle, you'll know they're talking about a dense, tangled, almost wild part of a forest, often tropical in nature. And when they say forest, Remember, it's a broader concept that includes many different environments around the world. Whether it's the mystery of the jungle or the majesty of the forest, both remind us of the incredible diversity and beauty of our planet's ecosystems. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.